Hey everybody, Dave here from Iographer. I wanted to take a moment to introduce you to our new multi-purpose tripod from Iographer. We've been looking around for a tripod that had panning capabilities, but yet was on a good budget because a lot of you are on a budget and we're trying to save money everywhere we can. So quality, build, uh, and functional as heck. So let's take a look at it. So we're gonna open it up, comes in our fancy new black and orange bag, or, or uh, case I should say. And inside it's got a carry case, first of all. So this is super cool with the Iographer logo on it. You can carry it around proudly. Uh, once you're done with that and you're ready to go to work, just unzip it. And we're gonna pop this out and here it is. And it's got three sections. So there's one. Stands up about 67 inches tall. Uh, and it actually gets taller than that because there's a telescoping ability of it as well. So I'm gonna leave it like this for now. We're gonna lock it down right here. It's got this nice little lock down. Also a little hook here in the bottom if you had to hook stuff or you wanted to put a weight down there to kind of hold it down even more, maybe windy conditions or whatever. It's got this carrying ability right here, little handle. I really like that a lot. And then here's this handle with two pants. So we're gonna release it a little bit. We're gonna release this side. And now you can go smoothly left and right. And you can put it as loose as you want. It's really up to you. And we'll just tighten it up for now. So it's super cool. You're following the action with sports um, and it's, it's a great little uh, tripod for that. We're gonna take the quick release off here. This is nice and big, so hopefully you people won't lose this. <laughs> uh, and then we're gonna put it into our um, iographer case here. So quarter 20, quarter 20, um, everything standard quarter 20. And let me just do this. And we're gonna screw it on. I was very impressed with this overall build, so we were very excited to, uh, to use these. We're going to lock it back in. It's very simple. It's locked and secure. Now I'm ready to pan left and right to follow the action. Loosen it up a little even more. You can see it's just nice and smooth. So you can follow the big game. The other thing that was really important was some people were asking us, um, we, you know, we want to shoot vertically sometimes. And I was like, why do you want to shoot vertically? I kind of get it because we were just at an event um, with Adobe and where we had a vertical green screen um, because, because of space um, uh, uh, constraints. And uh, we used it with this tripod. We actually tested it out. So on the right here, you'll see this little handle the screw here. And we're gonna unscrew it to the left. And now I can go vertical. So I can shoot vertically and you're good to go. So that feature is one that I thought was really, really cool. And let's put this back for now. We're gonna come back to them. We just screw it back in to tighten it up. It's great. It's got a level right here in case you wanted to, uh, to check that. It's got another level bubble down here. And over here on the side, we've got a little hand crank. So if we want to go even higher, we can. And then here's a lock for that. So you can lock it in really good. So it's really, really functional. Um, it's going to be included in all of our kits now and uh, really recommend it. Check it out now, the Iographer multi-use tripod. Thanks for watching.